Hi there, today I have a mini tutorial for you on how to do brindle coloring for your needle felting projects. I'll be applying this technique to a miniature Sharpe. To start, you will need at least two colors of wool roving to make the striping effect. This piece will have a blend of dark and light brown. Gently pull a bit of wool from one of your rovings. Just a few inches should naturally break free. You don't need to cut it. Then grab about the same amount from your second color. Lay the colors on top of one another and pull off any long ends, stacking the colors so the fibers are all about the same length. Grab the ends and gently pull the fibers apart. Restack them and continue this process until the two colors have blended together. If you have too much, you can always pull it apart and work in smaller batches. When the wool is blended, take a small amount and rub it between your hands. The friction will slightly felt the wool, fusing the blend together, making for easy placement on your work. Lay the colored wool down where you want it to go and hold it firmly. Press your piece down into your work surface and felt the wool gently into place. Gently blend the ends into your work. Repeat for the other side. Hold the loose ends firmly to the piece, then felt in place. Doing this ensures you'll have more control, you'll have a clean and tidy looking piece, and your work will felt much more quickly. Try to always felt down into your work surface. This helps you felt with more control, the right amount of pressure, and it will help prevent you from poking yourself with the very sharp needle. One final tip for getting the brindle look is to lay your roving's fiber grain on your piece in the direction you want the pattern to go. If you're unsure, use reference images to ensure realism. That's all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. If you liked what you saw, please like and subscribe. I'll have more needle felting videos coming soon. I'm Kim from Paper Moon Needle Felting, and you can also find me on Facebook and Instagram. Have a lovely day.